Good enough. Thank you. Like <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Welcome back to your channel. And we're gonna do part three of the greenhouse build today. And we've actually built some of the the bucket garden deal in here. We've actually built some of that already. We'll show you that in a second. We're gonna get the <clears throat> other side of the roof on today. Hopefully. It's supposed to rain again here in a little while. It's pretty cloudy right now, but it feels good. It's still so hot I'm sweating, but anyway, we're gonna try to get some of it done today. Uh, the roof, at least most of the roof, and possibly some of the front. doing is taking this is eight foot and uh, I just laid an eight foot board in the back and screwed it to the post then I cut two this eleven and a half right here and then put another eight footer against it and made like a little box and these fit perfectly in the box yeah, just like that okay. but I'm putting a uh, I'm putting a bottom board from the set on too so they don't fall through just in case like this yeah yeah like that on the bottom then it's gonna have some coming this way but right here in the middle we got a piece of the countertop left over from when we done the kitchen countertop i'm gonna put it right here for you and then we'll have maybe two buckets on each side of it two or three on each side of it Okay. 
cut it three feet and screw it on like that and then we'll put legs on it. Okay. You can put stuff under it too. Yeah. yeah. Put this right here and we'll cut it with a little saw. Putting some braces on here, keep it from wobbling, keep it good and stout.
guys, that's gonna do it for today. We'll be back here tomorrow, which will be on the same video. But anyway, it's starting to get late. We're gonna go get something deep. But we did get the other side of the plastic on the top. We got the metal in the front. I had to take that back here, back down, because we had to frame up for the buckets, for the bucket garden. But we got it back up, and then we got the metal down this side done. We run out of two by fours. I gotta put some two by fours all in here and frame it up more. We got the inside of it kind of framed up for. I'll probably come right here and frame out right here for two more buckets on each side. I should be able to get two buckets there. Let's see if we got an empty one. Yeah. Oh yeah, we'll get two more there. You know what, one thing I've done is frame up for two more buckets here. That way you'll have enough. Or my little pots. Or all the way around, yeah. Or a shelf, yeah, for your little pots. Some type of something to set them in. So, anyway. 7, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. A total of 18 buckets. We don't have 18 bucks. We need to get eight more. We have 10. So we need to get up to finish the bucket garden up. And here's the countertop. I ain't done with it yet. That's just sitting there. I need to fasten it down. But it turned out pretty good. I put the legs on it. And then here's the yes. other buckets are going to be. Yeah, here's the, for the other buckets. It's, like I said, it's pretty simple concept. Set your bucket in there, and then this board here holds the bottom for, like if it gets too heavy or whatever, that way it won't fall through, but it will set on the lift right there. Yeah. But I, I wanted to put this under it for, to hold the weight. And then probably more over here for the... Yeah. We may, um, just all depends on how, how it goes this year, I don't know, we may add to it, we may put another row, like I was saying earlier, we may put another row of buckets, like here, you know what I mean? Like another, build another rack for more buckets. You can probably get five more in here that way. Probably won't do more here, but we can do five more down that way. Yeah. So, I mean, that'll be, that'll be later down the road, but they're all, they're all working. So, but uh, we also have a thing that we ordered. It is a uh, solar powered uh, irrigation system that we're going to be running in here. So, I mean, it's going to water itself for us the whole nine. So it's going to be kind of a fully automated greenhouse. We'll have fans that come on when the sun comes up and it's going to water itself. But anyway, it's, it's coming a long way. We've got all the bucket thing framed up today. That's the main thing. So she can go ahead and get some stuff planted. We'll get the watering thing installed when it, get, when it gets here and we'll do a video on that, like a review on it. And I'll put the links and all that crap in the, down in the descriptions. Anyway, guys, if y'all haven't done so yet, hit that uh, like and subscribe button. It's free, it don't cost you anything if you don't keep up what we're doing. And also, if you're subscribed, I'll always check and make sure you're still subscribed because uh, YouTube has been kind of cutting people off somewhere or another. I don't know how that whole thing's working. But anyway, we'll be back on here tomorrow with more on the greenhouse. All right, that's gonna do it for, for today. We didn't get a whole lot done. She got some stuff done as far as in the garden. I had to make some bee traps and stuff like that, but we got a little bit of the metal on it. I need to find couple more pieces of metal going that side and then we got to start putting the plastic around and build the door and I got to do the water system the water system will be pretty soon it'll come pretty soon so anyway we'll get that done and it'll be like all solar powered irrigation system I'm gonna have fans in the eaves here probably vents in the bottom down there to suck cold air and blow our hot air out I think she showed her, her barrels those are gonna be great mines I got to build a trellis up and around the door, so the grapevine's gonna go up and around the doorway of the greenhouse. And she's starting to put her pots out here, if you wanna show that. Those are gonna be all the way around the fence. So, I mean, that, that's how many we can get in here. We'll probably put them all the way around the fence. You know, a few in the middle here and there, you know, wherever she wants them. Every how many plants she wants out here. My owl. Yeah, and then we got the owl to hopefully keep the birds from eating like the, the blueberries and stuff. So we'll see, I gotta screw it down. I'm gonna screw it down right there. Maybe scare some of the birds and stuff off. Anyway, it's coming along pretty good. We got all, like I said, we got all the roof on it. We didn't get a whole lot done today. Uh, like I said, we got some of the metal on the side of there and I need to get more metal to finish it with. And then we gotta get the plastic to finish it with. And I need more two befores and stuff like that. So anyway, guys, if you ain't done so yet, uh, hit that like and subscribe button. You're gonna keep up with what we're doing here on the mountain. See you on the next one.
Good job. I want to subscribe. I want to subscribe. There you go. Good job.